Hello and welcome back to the Craft Fox. My name is Brent, and today we are on episode 297 of the Death Walkthrough. Last time, if you haven't checked it out already, we defeated Nana um, in Gutenstadt. We, we finished Gutenstadt as well, and we made our way into the Black Licorice Forest, which is here. Um, and I, in between episodes, I defeated a couple of these guys. It was only two fights, which was cool to get some samples. And we are talking to Greta now. This sample feels different from the others. I do not know if it is sour, but it certainly does not smell sweet. What are they making this with? Maybe the witches will know. They are based in a treehouse in the denser part of the forest. It should be easy to spot. I will meet you there. Right. Um, obviously, the treehouse is just here, as we saw last episode. This is where the um, thumbnail is taken. I thought it was fitting, you know, since we're kind of on the side of the witches. Makes sense to have the witch house as, as the... You! Easy now, there were some mistakes made, but the wizard is here to help. Then why did they attack us? Think back and remember I was there. Did they attack you? Or did you do that thing where you yell curses and freak them out? Well, I mean, we did it not do that thing. Curses! The weird sisters can decide if you stay. Uh-huh. Okie dokie. Sounds, sounds sus. You brought us gummy samples from Sweetsburg. Oh, you know, we went to Sweetsburg to study the gummy. Something stopped us. What was it, Prudence? You can get over it any time now. I said you were all coming on too strong, so I tried it my way. An advertiser should have better communication skills. What do you know? Prudence and I led the marketing department before Nana converted it into the Gingerbread Room Academy of Mascot und Assassins. What do you mean, who's Prudence? <laughs> She's standing right there, you silly card player person. <laughs> Prudence is her <clears throat> familiar. We just assume she is invisible and inaudible and intangible. Is that not right, Prudence? Prudence says take your gummy samples to my sisters. They know the fairy ways of treats and sweets. They will find your answers. I really don't like Samantha. She's kind of annoying. I don't... I just her familiars... I say familiars, you'll understand why in the future oh look the gummy samples how lovely but you do know this is not enough yeah we cannot just sniff the sour gummy and boop have the answer ah visits today and there's no respect for science we need on the process gummy jelly and traditional non-mass produced gummy creature to compare the first thing is easy just get the gummy jelly from the black licorice cheese well, easy, except for the chocolate mousse that gather around the black licorice trees, sister. Yeah, obviously. You have to fight the chocolate mousse before collecting the black licorice. Everyone knows that. Why even say it? I say it because you did not say it. Anyway, also get a traditional gummy from Sugar Plum Sherry. She still makes them the old-fashioned way. Okie dokie. Sounds like we have a new mission to defeat mousse. I don't like this. This is so sad. Defeating three chocolate moose, it makes me really mad, because why why would I want to defeat them? Also their death, which is annoying. Um, but yeah, right, I will be back once I have defeated three of these magnificent creatures. Um, it'll have to be four, unfortunately, but we have to take our, take take the pain away somehow. Right, I am back. We have just defeated my friends, the chocolate moose over there, unfortunately. So sad, so sad. But now we are getting some trees, which in Testrom, uh, you had to struggle to get these. It was so hard. It was nearly impossible because they were just gone instantly everywhere, um, at least when I was going through this area. So yeah, but hey, there we go. There's five. Now we need to go to Sugar Plum Sherry. Sounds like a cool name, not gonna lie. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. She is just chilling over here, up this way. Up this little path here is Sherry. Hello. Hi there. Welcome, true believer, to Sugar Plum Sherry's old fashioned gummy companions. Not affiliated with Nana's old fashioned caramel delights. 
we make gummies the real old-fashioned way. Sprinkling the black licorice trees with sweet fairy dust. Then carefully molding the jelly by hand. Then slowly, meticulously dusting it with fairy dust again to bring it to life. Well, I say life. Gummies are not alive. They are like the robots, but chewable. Yeah, used to be every family had their own workhorse gummy companion. It was a rite of passage to make one. Anyway, how many gummies can I get you? One? Oh, that is too bad. I do not have that many. My stock was stolen, you see. By Nana. Yeah, they do not like competition. Took my gummies to the logging camp for shipping back to Caramel City. If you save them, I could give you one as reward. Um, right, also the, um, the, the lemon head is just in there, by the way, just in case you didn't see that. Oh, there it is. Right, let us head to the logging camp. Surely nothing bad could go wrong. Oh, hello, sweetie. Welcome to Nana's old-fashioned gummy logging operations. Um, do not take this the wrong way, but leave. <clears throat> now. Oh, Nana knows you, sweetie, and she does not want the trouble. If you have come for Sherry's gummies, sorry, Nana cannot let you have them. According to Nana's old-fashioned caramel legal code, subsection 32, paragraph 12, we own the gummy recipe and thus all gummies. So if you go into the warehouse and take them, my fulfillment artisans are well within their legal rights to destroy you. So please leave and have an old fashioned delightful day. Um, how about no? Just just a suggestion there. How much gold? Ooh, 863, that's not too bad. That is not too bad. Right, let's head into the, the logging camp because I don't really care what Nana says, you know. We're breaking the rules. We've already defeated her once, you know. Might as well just break all of her rules. She's already gone, basically. So it's fine. It is. Who are you? Wait, wait a minute. Are you the wizard? The one Nana's old-fashioned news broadcast said is an evil witch? Yeah, it is definitely the one. They say this wizard is the scion of the world tree. Maybe we take the lunch break now. Nana cancelled the lunch breaks. Uh, said they disrupted workflow. So now we just leave early. Do we, though? If we met our daily quotas in time, which, yeah, were increased recently, but, um, let us talk later. Leave now. Hmm, that's a bit of a shame. <laughs> bit of a shame there. Uh-oh. You do realize you are now stealing from Nana, sweetie. Oh, Nana simply cannot let you do that. Right, we are facing boss Nana this time. Boss Nana, who would have thought? Um, let's quickly, quickly put in some faints, I guess, just in case we need them. Don't know if we will, but hey, we will try. We have a, um, Sentimentalist, um, who is Myth, and also Nana, who is Storm. Rank 19 Storm boss person thing. Um, yo, there's the Goomies that we're saving, by the way. They look so cute and adorable. What is she doing? Blading? Okay, that's fair enough. Fair enough. I wonder how many times we can defeat Nana in one world. Let me know down in the comments how many times you think. This is number two so far that I have done. So, yeah. Um, right, we were stunned, which is very, very lovely. So much thanks, Nana. I appreciate being stunned. Really do. Really, really do. Oh, Kraken. Oh, my gosh. She is hitting with the good spells today. Jeez. Oh, be careful. Be careful. Krakens are coming out at you. 830? Oh no. Nana means business. Nana means business. Troll. Imagine if it was the, like, summon the minion one. That would be crazy. It's not. But it would be crazy if it was. <laughs> um, right. Here is a blade. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And we can do blades, which is good. She might enfeeble. It is a possibility. We're just gonna blade again and then hit. She doesn't have too much health. So I think a scarecrow can kill with two blades. Um, okay, Hammer of Thor. They love this spell, by the way. And Caramel, they use this all the time. Every single storm thing that we've defeated so far has used this spell. Um, it's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. They love it. It is a cool spell as well, and you don't really see it often, so I enjoy it. I enjoy seeing it. Um, however, Frog, do not enjoy seeing. So boring. So boring. 
you know, just plain boring frog. Seen it a million times, especially if you have a myth before Authorus was good. Um, well, it was good before, but before it was even betterer. Even betterer. Because that is words. That is words, right. Blade, fair enough. She she blading up to hit us. She trying to go for the one in a million. That, that's what she's trying to do. 100% bet. Right, Scarecrow, hopefully this kills. It should. It'll at least kill the minion. I know that for sure. Um, but Nana should also die, right? Nope, Nana did not die. She has too much block. Too much block there. Is a shame. Or we just don't have enough damage. That could be a thing. Could be a possibility there. Could be a possibility. How much health? 2,000. Ooh, right. Time for a faint, I think. Methinks it's time for a faint. Yes. Yeah. Oh, look. Again, Hammer of Thor. Like I said, they just love it. They love it. It is such a cool spell, though. I really enjoy this spell. It's quite nice to see. Oof. That did a little bit more than last time. Oh, well. It's still only but a scrape. It's okay. We can survive, I think. I think we can survive. Wow. We are just getting not much. Not much in the way of actual usable spells right now. So many enchants. Not enough everything else. Not good. If we could get a Lulu, that would be fantastic. Um, you know, that would be pretty cool. Nope. Um, we're just going to discard this and this. Because two faints are definitely going to kill with no matter what we hit with. So, that's what we're doing. What is this? You used the accuracy for a blade. Fair enough, you know. Thought I was going to mantle you or something, obviously. Oh, look. Now we get a Lulu and a Scarecrow, but we're going to Lulu because we've already Scarecrowed this fight. So might as well shake it up a little bit. Shake it up. Please don't fizzle this. Because I believe this gives a mantle, which is not fun. Not fun. Gotta love Catalan. Such a weird spell. This could actually do quite a lot. Because that's 30 plus 30 plus 30. That's 90. That's plus 90. That's basically more than a faint. So that's slightly worrying. Yeah, that did quite a bit there. Minus 25. Please don't fizzle this. We didn't fizzle. We are epic gamers. Best gamer in the world. That's me. Best gamer. Best wizard ever. Don't look it up because it's probably not true, but, but it obviously is true. Crit. And this is definitely going to kill with 270s. That's like a lot of damage. Yeah, there we go. 10,000. Fair enough. Fair enough. Love to see it. Amazing. The Grand Nana will hear about this. Sure thing. Sure thing. Produces Thermal Suit. That's an interesting name. I wonder if it was... If, if that's like... If that's like a hint to the producer of the game, who is a fire wizard, and goes under the name of um, Professor Falmere on the message boards. Who knows? Who knows? That would be my guess. That would, that's quite a cool easter egg if that is true which i assume it is um yeah only only cool kids would know right let's head back to sherry and give her her share of the gummies because we need one for ourselves as well we need one Let, let's let's go sugar plum sherry give us some stuff wow you found my gummies wonderbar and as agreed you may keep one as reward what do you need it for, if I might ask? What? That is inconceivable! Sour gummies? Bah! Insane troll talk, that is! Well, take your gummy and see if you can sort out the problem. Yep, hopefully we can, Sherry. Hopefully we can. Let's just remove all of this because we don't need this. I also forget that we don't actually need to carry potent because we have a card of potent. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. How are we going with, um, sh ooh, snake attack. 34 now, wow. That is quite a few. Quite a few, not gonna lie, quite a few of them. Right, let us head back to the witch house. The witch house, it's got a really cool W. I don't actually notice that before um, on the door. Well, I'll look at it once we go out again because it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Indora, hello. The mean wizard returns. Let us see what they brought. Hmm, the licorice looks clean. The sour is not natural. And Sherry's gummy is also clean. Which means I was right. It is a problem with Nana's manufacturing process. What about the Goombajak samples? They're different from the others. 
Yes, yes, good eye, but not relevant. They are not made from the gumdrop trees, but from the candy corn syrup. It is not sour, just bland. But why is the corn syrup bland? No, fairy dust. I bet. And without the sweet fairy dust, maybe candy corn gummies slowly turn sour. We must experiment. I know that. But first, we need the raw candy corn and then some sort of sourizer to add to it. The sugar dandruff of the sour patch goats will do. There is a candy corn farm nearby. I will go there for some samples. Visit. You get the sugar dandruff and come find me. Okie dokie, let's go get some sugar dandruff. Um, we'll go and see where these guys are, just in case you don't know. But yeah, there's the W on the outside. I'll look at it from the other way as well, just to give you a better look. A better look at the W. Look at it, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. You can just see it in the background. W, obviously, for um, Wizards United. Don't look it up. Definitely not for witches, because there ain't no witches in Caramel, you know? Definitely not witches. Pfft. Who who would who would see witches in caramel? <laughs> Not me. Imagine being a witch. Wow, crazy. Cannot relate. Um, right. These are the sour patch goats. They're star, which is crazy. You don't see star mobs often in anywhere other than Celestia. So yeah, that's a thing. Otherwise, I'll be back in just a little bit. I am back. We are killing these guys, and hopefully collecting the last sugar dust or whatever it is called the dandruff thing i don't know i don't know whatever it is whatever it is we getting it we did get it nice these guys look so cute as well i love them i love them all of these if this was a pet i would definitely have definitely would have i mean i mean you just say that about everything in caramel it just looks so good it's fantastic absolutely fantastic um yes greta hello did you get the dandruff wunderbar i was gathering some candy corn but i was distracted by the farm itself I mean, look at it. It is like someone found a traditional country farm and dropped a gummy plant on top of it. But why? It's a lot of effort just to make Goomba Jacks. And why plant all this candy corn in the first place? Nobody really buys it. Nana just sells it as the healthy caramel snack. Anyway, sorry, distracted. Let us just get that candy corn. Uh-huh. Right, we're so close to a level. Ooh, can we get a level today? Or do we have to wait till next episode? Because I don't want to start too much in the candy corn farm today. I don't want to have too much to do in it. Again, this was impossible to do in test run, but it's so much easier when you can just go around and spam X and um, just get them this all. This should be enough. Let us get it back to the Ved sisters. Right. Let's head back to Endora. Can we just... We can use the Nanovator. We're, we're going to cheat. We're going to cheat and um, just use the Nanovator because it's slightly closer ever so slightly closer and would take slightly less time than walking all the way there um but hey that's just how i am i'm lazy fight me okay fight me i'm lazy it's just how it is sorry it's just how it be right endora let us see what you say about this where are you you're in the back in the back room ha 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 ha, -ha. hello you are back. Now let us mix the sourizing agents with the unsweetened candy corn and wunderbar. My theory is correct. My theory is correct. I said that without fairy dust sweetening, the candy corn could turn sour. Me. Your obsession with credit is just sat. But look at these Sweetsburg samples. They are sour now. See how they now compare to our sour candy corn? They are the same. Sweetsburg gummies are candy corn too. The sour just made it hard to notice. But these samples have no sugar dandruff. Exactly. We have proven that candy corn can go sour, but not why it keeps doing it. We need to identify their mysterious sourizing ingredient. There is a gummy plant at the nearby farm. A strange one. I say we bust in there and see what they're doing firsthand. Are you in, Wizard? sounds fun we're gonna go back to the candy corn farm and that's probably where we're gonna end off the episode but i know we've got some dialogue there most likely so we'll we'll listen to that but i can say things are about to heat up a little bit um and you can take that as a physical thing is like that that's what's going to happen it's heating up if you want to believe me with that you can um you know it, it happens it happens but people who know know and it's about to heat up. 
or at least you know get a little bit warmer dun 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 any dialogue what yes. in the tarnation are you the vomits to who i am referring doing by the door of my wunderbarn weaver uh just so excited about seeing how nana operates she is so great yeah I do not, as they say, rootin' and a tootin' believe you, but I also do not care. The nana, she rosso rangos my farm and turns it into the factory. Ooh, it's so important, they say. We're making no super top secret gummy jelly to spread the happiness initiative. Do not tell anyone. Patui, I say, all this does is attract a brutal pest at a rascally. Perhaps if you clear them out of my silo, I leave the factory open, yeah? Right, I think next episode we are going to go head into the silo and clear out the brutal problem that she has. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. If you're subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.